Now we're here to, we're gonna resurface the pool deck with the same same product we used to resurface this with, to color it. So we're gonna get this prepped today. It's raining right now, but that's okay. We're gonna pressure wash it, clean it, get all the mold and mildew off it, and then we're gonna use the same resurfacing product that we use on the walkways. So we're getting this pool deck prepped for our concrete waterproofing coating. It's the coating we use on pool decks, patios, walkways. Just gives them a nice brand new looking surface. As you can see, this one here is about 25 years old. It's still in pretty good shape, but the surface is pretty much just worn. So our concrete waterproofing coating is gonna give it a brand new look, we'll make it look like a brand new pool deck. Today what we're doing is we're just scrubbing it, cleaning it, getting all the mold and mildew off, any, any loose dust and debris or concrete. There really doesn't seem to be any loose concrete mostly mold and mildew as you can see right there but that right there is a good surface for us to put our coating on right there there's plenty of uh, grip to adhere to and it'll cover up all the aggregate and all that stuff give it a nice brand new look So, I mean, we could just pressure wash it, but it seems to be uh, just taking it off a little faster because there's so much mold and mildew using the scrubber today. I've got a really hard bristled scrub brush underneath this thing. See if I can show you here. That's what I'm using right there. That's that's a really hard bristle brush, so that that removes about 90% of it. You see how black that is. You can see where they put the cover on, and then outside the cover, it's 10 times worse. But this is removing quite a bit of it. And then the pressure washer is taking all the rest off. how we clean it. Well, that's how we deep clean it. If it wasn't so dirty we probably wouldn't have needed the floor buffer with a scrub brush. But it really, that scrub brush really makes a difference. Look how white this is turning after it dries. I mean that was black. Black and green from the mold. Now it's nice and white. So we'll let this dry out. Give it 24 hours. Then we'll come back put our coating on.
So today we're here to put our concrete waterproof coating on this pool deck and resurface it. We're going to resurface back down over that walkway too. Two coats of this we put on, it waterproofs the concrete, keeps any water from penetrating. We use a three, eight, three quarter inch nap roller. We'll roll both edges with edge rollers and then one guy will come right behind him with a big roller. The stuff we're using today is called, it's deck seal from Stone Edge Surfaces. It's a single component concrete waterproofer. That's it right there. So it goes on about 100, 150 square feet a gallon for the first coat and then about 200 for the second, depending on how porous. This concrete's probably 30 years old anyway. But it's in pretty good shape, just looks, looks old. So to prep this, we pressure washed it, scrubbed it, pressure washed it, and patched any little pieces that needed to be patched. Wasn't much really to patch. And then we've let it dry out for a few days. So now we're back. So what are you thinking so far, guys? Let me know down in the comments. Uh, do you like the way this makes it look? I mean, I've used this stuff a lot over the years, and I I stand by it. It it bonds, it adheres really, really well. What's really cool about it also is it's really easy to, to coat again, too. If two years, four years, five years, six years down the road you want to recoat it, it, you can recoat right over it. Just sand it, clean it. And coat right over it you could change the color if you want um, that's this stuff like I said this stuff's really really nice I've had it on my basketball court for seven years um, and I just recoated it and and only really needed it in a couple of spots it was just wearing a little thin it wasn't really peeling off or anything and we actually just changed the colors I went from the colors that my daughter liked when she was younger to now the colors that my my son likes because he's 10 years old so uh, you can recoat over these really easy. It's just a matter of cleaning it really good and you know putting the new coat right over it if you want. But for today, I mean, what this looked like before to what it looks like now is uh, is, is ba basically just like a brand new looking deck. I mean, it's hard to keep these pool decks clean up where we are in Maine because we get four different seasons and we get a lot of mold and mildew especially where the stuff stays in the shade a lot so <clears throat> being able to clean it put a coating on like this now this is going to resist the mold and mildew a lot more than the, just the bare concrete's going to because the moisture and stuff isn't going to be able to penetrate into the concrete now it's just going to run off so it's not going to get anywhere as near as dirty as it did before like you saw putting the second coat on usually just met, just requires us to let the first coat dry tack free and that's going to be dependent on what the weather is that day so most days we can get the second coat on on the same day and just get the project finished right up it really transforms you know what a patio looks like whether it's a pool patio a regular back patio a sidewalk um, just about anything you're doing now we don't we don't uh, drive on this, so you wouldn't want to put this on a driveway. 
it's not that type of coating it's definitely good for foot traffic it's but not for not for hot tires like that you gotta you gotta probably stain your driveway and seal it if you want color to your driveway um, but this is definitely good for just about anything else the second coat goes on much much easier than the first coat you know the first coat you're forcing down into the pores uh, it, it requires just a little bit more pressure on the roller to get it down and get it good coverage the second coat rolls on really really easy once that first coats on it's a lot less work and you get twice the coverage with the second coat too I'll have a link down in the description guys for this product if you want to check it out you can you know you'll be able to link to their website check it out and uh, if it's something you think you want to do to yours just basically you know you got to follow the same steps we did here usually the cleaning the pressure washing the cleaning and if you got any little bit of patching that's what takes the most time putting the actual coating down I mean that isn't too bad really one person could do this um, I mean this is about eight eight hundred square feet here one one person it would take twice as long as it did what we did but you could do it and you could do half one day half another day too it dries basically all the same coat you may have a, a little tiny bit of shadowing here and there a little bit depending on the porosity of the concrete and all that that's pretty normal but for the most part it dries it dries nice even and uh, we've never really had any trouble with it so Darren and Luca finishing that piece up we went over the sidewalk that goes down to the driveway which we had coated a, a couple of years ago with a different color so now we're making everything all the same color and you can see how easy we recoated over that it's so it's basically just dip and roll probably you know cutting in the edges and stuff like that takes the most time the 18 inch roller goes down pretty easy so the guy doing the 18 is not too bad it's the you know the guy or gal that's cutting in all the edges that's really doing most of the work here we're gonna we're gonna put the second coat down that walkway and then I'm gonna give you a finish a finish look right here so stay tuned for that let me know down in the comments if you're thinking you might want to do this stuff and uh, let me know if you like it thanks a lot guys So this is our concrete waterproofing coating we put on to resurface pool decks, patios, walkways, sidewalks. Two coats. It's a concrete waterproofer. So it seals the surface, keeps water from penetrating. Two coats though. But it goes on really nice. And it adheres to the concrete really, really good. So we've used this for a lot of pool decks basketball courts, walkways, patios. Looking pretty good. We've got that one little last piece to do, then we'll be all done here today on this one.